Oh my god. So yeah. Uh John Udaf scale. So uh this is a new addition to the fleet guys and uh yeah. I went on and made a move, man, uh, and got another truck. I think I had mentioned it in a video, uh, several videos back about I was thinking about it, and uh, went out and stopped at a dealership. I had been looking, I've been looking for about a year, a little over a year, maybe two years, and uh, man, there it was. Uh, exactly what I was looking for. Not necessarily a Ford, but it is a Ford F-150. Just like what I have already. And um, man, it kind of dotted all the I's and crossed all the T's for what I was looking for. Uh, and uh, I went ahead and made the purchase, man. Uh, and uh, glad I did. Picked it up a couple of days ago. And uh, I think it's gonna work out well for us. I mean, take a look, man. This thing is as clean as it can be. And this was the game changer right here. That right there, that cover. That was the game changer. That was the game changer. This cover. I mean, this bad boy slides in and it slides out. And those covers right there, I know they're pretty pricey. Let me let you look at the interior. Take a look at this. CD player, radio, all that. Okay, guys, and here's the back seat. I mean, this back seat, take a look at it, man. It doesn't even look like anybody sit on this back seat. And here's <clears throat> the other side. <clears throat> and man, fuck, uh, uh, it's really, for work trucks, it's, it's, it's pretty loaded for work truck. And you know, I, I, I wasn't really looking for anything with all the bells and whistles, but I kind of got bells and whistles. Uh, it's got power door locks, uh, power windows, you know, all, all, all the stuff you like to have. You know, my other truck, it just got the regular wind up windows. I, I would have settled for that, but when I saw it, when I looked at it, it dotted all the eyes again, like I said, and it crossed all the two. Uh, rides nice, man, nice ride. Just what I'm, what I, what I was looking for, and so my plan is I'm gonna keep the F-150, and my plan is to add a wrap to each week uh, next week. One day I'm gonna add a wrap, and I'm gonna uh, send a guy out. So uh, be looking, looking to see that. So uh, leave a comment and tell me what you think. Did I get a good buy? A scale on case what we do guys. Leave a comment. And so what I'm gonna be doing today guys, <clears throat> I'm gonna hook it up. I'm gonna take it out Monday. Today is Saturday. Uh, like I said, I got the truck a couple days ago. I got it on Thursday. And um, I'm gonna be switching everything over out of the other F-150 into this one. Uh, but again, uh, I'm going to, uh, like I say, plan to add a route. N not, maybe not send out a whole crew, but you know, I, I, that would that would be nuts. Tell me, tell me if that's send out a crew. It's, 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 it gets harder and harder. Man. The more I think about trying to send a crew out, I, you know, I, it just hadn't hadn't happened. I mean, you know, I don't, I don't know if it will. I don't know. You tell me what you think. Tell me if it's hard to put a crew together these days. Uh, but I do plan to add a route to, to each week. One day. 
I'm going to add a route. And then I'm going to use the other F-150 for that purpose. Maybe two days. Might be able to do it two days. But the lawns are there. I'm not worried about getting the lawns. The lawns are there. It's just taking those lawns, those new lawns, and making another route. And then having someone, what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave someone here in my subdivision and let them work that. Because we have enough lawns in this subdivision for that. Now, you know what I want to know. What do you think I paid for this truck? Leave a comment. All right. See you.